Hello again, footy fans. Welcome along to footytips.com.au, our preview for NRL Round 4. Russ Barwick alongside Brett Kamali, the so-called expert, who got five out of whatever it was last week, which is an improvement on the one and the two you got the previous week. So Imagine I when I get eight, eight in a row, Russ. <laughs> Mate, there's football clubs that are inconsistent and very poor. But th- th- we're not paying them the big bucks that you're on. We, okay. The footy tipster demands a better performance this week. I will perform and get eight out of eight. Right. Roosters versus Manly. Uh, Kieran four and under doubt uh, on Friday night with a calf injury. Who's your prediction? I think the Roosters win this football game. They are the best football side in the competition. They're going to have a week that's going to have no dramas in it because Manly got a lot of the distractions. Manly love adversity and everything else, but yes. I just think the Roosters too good. Big crowd, great victory. Okay. Dragons unbeaten. Hands up. Who would have thought that? Was the case? No one, exactly. After three weeks of the competition, they play the Broncos at home on Friday night and a chance for them to go four out of four. Yeah, which could be a great victory. Josh Dugan, room to be playing, which would be a huge boost for them. I think the Dragons have been winning, but I'm unsure of the opposition they've played. So this is a great test from... Yeah. I think the Broncos will win and win this one away from home. No, no, I'm, I'm with the Dragons. The Eels take on the Panthers in the Battle for the West at uh, Parramatta Stadium on Saturday afternoon. Well, let's hope there's a great crowd. Let's hope the pride of the West get out and support this game. Uh, Chris Sandow back, which could be exciting or, or could go horribly wrong because I don't know if he suits structure, which Brad Arthur brings. Panthers have been great. Moreland's kick on the sideline last week to win the yep. game. Confidence boost. Penrith to win. And they deserve to win it as well. Bulldogs are in uh, Perth taking on the Melbourne Storm. Storm are going to back it up after Monday night football and the long flight, so it's no easy task. No short turnaround and a long, long, long trip. But I think the Melbourne Storm, just the class and the ability to win tight games and just go an extra level when it's required, they'll get home. Can If Tony Williams is hopping on the plane, can he somehow find momentum, aggression, fire up when he gets to Perth because he's got to run the ball. If you're that big, you should be able to break more than a marshmallow. Yes. I agree with you. On Sunday, the Warriors have moved another home game, this time to Wellington to take on the Tigers, but their record away from Mount Smart is nothing short of disgraceful. Brilliant last at the Warriors, but without any confidence, how could you say consistency fits into their vogue? They do struggle away. West Tigers sent a message last week, great statement. Robbie Farrow was very aggressive after the game saying, we demand some respect. They got it. They've got to back it up. Tigers to win. I remember them beating uh, the Warriors in Christchurch, I think, by 50 points one year. It was a while ago, but uh, they certainly do like to travel. Souths take on Canberra at ANZ Stadium. Souths under massive pressure. Discipline, dramas in the forward pack. Uh, I think the back line is struggling. Isaac Luke out for possibly 10 weeks. Raiders were poor, but I think they'll bounce back. I think okay. Canberra to win in an upset. Okay, on Sunday, the Knights, who are in desperate trouble at the moment, up against the Sharks. They might actually take the plate around, a la what happens in church, to try and raise a bit of money for these two clubs. Yeah, they'll have to share the money, though, <laughs> Russ. They're not both travelling very well. Newcastle, a lot of dramas. A big week with Alex McKinnon, unfortunately, yeah, the drama terrible. occurred. Whether they unite or whether they just have distractions away from football. I think Newcastle to win. I think too many dramas in both camps, but they're at home. Yeah, and on Monday Night Football, a later start. Titans up against the Cowboys uh, out in the Gold Coast. Yeah, Titans winning last week, but still haven't seen any style of decent football no. from them. Albert Kelly was brilliant. Cowboys will get hit with a massive stick from the little coach, uh, yep. and they'll respond Cowboys to win. Okay, a couple of upsets being predicted by the man who said eight out of eight this week. So let's see how he goes. Roosters in the opening game with the Broncos to make it the Friday double. Then on Saturday, the Panthers and the Storm the Sunday. Tigers, Canberra and the Newcastle Knights while wrapping it up with the Cowboys on Monday night. I reckon there's probably four there, just as a matter of interest. We'll wait and see what happens. Uh, We'll be back next week with more from footytips.com.au.